All right, so here we go on my Linux struggle playing Kunimitsu, I know real. This was a pretty good match, I would say, uh, deathmatch series. And I decided to do some commentating. Um, it's funny that it says here that my throw countering is an A because throughout this set, I feel like my throw breaking was straight terrible. So here we are. Here we are at the start. Round one. So generally speaking, I like to start off like trying to poke, backdash, create space. This guy was really, really aggressive. And oh, come with Kuna right there. And you know he's he's really like closing the gap. You press the button at the end. Super aggressive. So at this point, I'm thinking, okay. This guy is just going to be pressing buttons, and I should be able to easily beat him. That is wrong. Um, that was pretty punishable. He didn't get a good punish. I blocked that. I'm like, alright, he has nothing left. But, here I go. Get caught with the grab. Into this little setup. Now, I don't know. I don't think that's guaranteed. This right there, because it was off axis, that combo whiffed. And just like that, he runs up and catches me. I was so hot when I got caught with that. I, I'm not even gonna lie. Now, you're gonna see me challenge this like so many times. And every time I try to challenge it, I get blown up. Because I feel like I should be able to jab it. Um, the little uh, cart will spin kick. So, all of these things. Like, he's just, literally, he's just jumping in there. Now, I know that's punishable, but I realize um, now, looking back at the replay, that that was definitely the wrong punish for me to do there. And I'm literally just being smoked, right? It seems like every match I'm about to win, and then I just get smoked somehow. And I was really actually kind of feeling a bit discouraged, because I'm like, man, this guy is literally just, like, beating me down. Like, do I even want to play him again? But I can hear my detractors saying, oh, play him, play him, you know, so on and so forth. So, oh god, big punish. Oh. So, right now I'm at the line where I could conceivably um, start to fall lower and risk demotions and so on and so forth. So, here, um, I decided to go ahead and rematch him again as, you know, he walks forward. So, here we are, match started, cool. So I said, okay, um, you know what, I really shouldn't be getting caught with a lot of this stuff. I should probably actually be trying to sidestep. So you can see I'm trying to poke and sidestep, but he's so quick, it's like he's just catching me. Um, it feels like that down for two tracks a lot. So, this was something that I saw in a, in a video where you can use set like one, two. And I never really saw the point of using set one, two, but now I feel like it's a control tool to stop people from uh, just pressing buttons. And it doesn't even make any sense like this. He's just, he's just swinging and swinging. Round right? two. And, you know, a lot of times uh, people say, oh, well, you show replays where, um, you know, you're just way better than a person, right? While I am better than a lot of people, I'm not way better than a lot of people, right? that makes sense. It's just because I punish a lot of people um, for doing dumb things, like how he's punishing me. Again, getting smoked. But... This is where he gets cocky, and this is how I beat people, right? I beat them by them overstepping and giving me some space. And then once they start to do that, that's when I start to go in. So, I'm trying to like, oh my gosh, I couldn't even believe that. That move was so slow, but I wanted to start using it. He grabs, oh, he just grabs the mess on me. Oh, there he goes, he's pressing buttons. Oh. And power crush. So this is my first round out of like I don't know how many rounds. At least I didn't get no real round. 
Like that was really, really slow. Um, ooh. So the funny thing is, it's like I know that I should be ducking that, but I'm actually like a little kid for me to duck it. Like, look at this. I'm not. I'm not even pressing buttons. And this man is just. He's just swinging. Ooh. Big combo. Okay, throw the kunai. Yep. Kaboom. Yep. Oh, that should go. Alright, so that was really good that I actually was able to make that comeback there. Fight. Alright, oh, a little DSS. Oh man, there it is again. I had another opportunity to duck it, but you know, I'm afraid to duck it. And that little uh, jump and kick actually knocks me out of set, which is the dash. Alright, I feel like he should have blocked that. Oh my god, look at that. Like, I wonder what what game he has. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, that's what good defense is right there. I blocked his whole entire power crush on reaction. So I'm on the board. I can't even believe I made that comeback. He was literally winning the whole entire time and I just beat him with like defense and patience. So at this point now, it's like 1-1, one, one, right? I'm pretty much we're playing till um, either one of us gets promoted or one of us gets demoted. That's usually how these matches kind of go. As you start to get to like um, the higher levels, Round one. more people uh, start to deathmatch. Okay, so, you know, I'm getting some momentum back. Can't block a little to save my life, apparently. So I'm trying to box him, yep. That's one thing about Kunimitsu is that I'm really like Tried to actually go low there and I stuffed his low. That's funny. And power crush to close it out. One of the things I love about Kunimitsu is the fact that, you know, she's like a boxer, you know. I can throw some jabs, poke, 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 poke. So here he goes. With the step kick. Oh my gosh, down forward too. It's too good. I feel like that down forward has to have some tracking. It's like really good. That's something that I probably don't have. Oh my god, he's, he's gonna just pressure me. I'm gonna lose some health. There it is again. Didn't duck it. He tried to grab me. I blocked that low in the clutch. I know he's trying to fish for a low. I did it again. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Big whip. Oh my gosh, that's it. He's got it here. Oh, look at that. See? And this time I'm patient, so I didn't get like knocked out. Now he's getting desperate. You know what that means? When they get desperate, they start to like try to like rush in the crap. Right? That's what happens. Like, when when people see that you have defense, they just start rushing in the grab. But now as soon as I say that, I just get destroyed. See that? So, here we are again. Um, I'm like trying to, trying to keep him still. Oh my gosh. Pat, was that like a counter hit? Oh, thank god he dropped it. So, I mean, if he's crouching like that, I'm just throw the kunai. That's how much he's thrown moves. And that kunai caught him twice. He tried to go low again. Oh my goodness. I can't believe that I brought that back. But, you know, these are some thoughts uh, you know, that I was having. And this was a really a big turnaround from the previous matches that we were having. So this is going to be like our final match here. And whether he stays or whether he goes, you know, we're just going to find out. But, you know, I was really proud of the fact that I was able to make adaptations to some of the things that he was doing. Another thing that's just so weird about these commentaries is like I'm doing with no sound. I'm just talking to my screen. Fight. Oh my gosh. That was super plus. So, I'm just trying to space him, but again, big down for two, big combo. 
Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, I oh, missed it. Um, I'm trying to get in there. Alright. Press the buttons. Call them pressing buttons. I'm starting to mix in some other things. Seeing how it works out. Oh my gosh. Like, it amazes me how, like, that even, that even got me. I call it the fake. Mmm, oh gosh. Big. That, he's getting a lot of miles out of down for it too. I can't even lie. KO. Now see, I'm pretty sure I tried to backdash and he caught my backdash, which is crazy. Probably should have just blocked. But you know, I'm still trying to bob and weave. Okay, yeah, I'm poking him back, poke, poke. Look at this. Mm. I'm trying to power crush through some of the stuff. He catches me. He's so good with that little dragon's tail. Normally I don't get caught by that. Oh my gosh, here we go. Big combo. What is he gonna do? Run up and grab me? Probably. Oh. Button. Why was he pressing buttons from so far away? He caught me with another dragon's tail. He caught me with like everything single one this match. Like, you know, I've barely blocked it and got punished. Uh, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Okay, he's on tilt. That was a crazy comeback. Uh, oop, okay. Yep. Not pressing buttons from that. Okay. Oh my gosh. Big grab combo. Boom, boom. Oop. Alright, looks good. Okay. Hit with the shimmy. The down for two. He just relentlessly pressuring. Now, around here, I felt like he was like starting to cheat because we had no delay. No rollback this entire time. And then all of a sudden we're having these big delays. I think that he was trying to like uh, get my defense to crack. But, you know, I was being like super clutch. Like just raw, just muscle memory. And I catch in there. He literally was he literally was trying to play keep out with the power brush. And I literally baited it out and then just like right. You know, to be honest, I didn't even think it was going to do that much damage, but it did. So I was able to steal that match, which was pretty good. Yeah. Oh, power curve. Boom, boom, boom. Just chipping me away. Boop, 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 boop. Alright. Okay. That's good. Alright. See, I'm trying to keep my distance and not go for some strings. Oh, yep. Ooh, big win. And this might close. No, it's not. I thought I was gonna close it out. Oh my gosh, yeah. He lives. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Big punch. He went for the gusto. It was a great set. I really like playing this guy. And it really shows like growth and adaptation during gameplay. And this is pretty much it. Uh, he doesn't rematch with the end. Spoiler alert. And this is the end of the video.